Hello, my Pisces friends. This is the love reading for June 2016. Again, for Pisces. Well, for our new people here, thank you for visiting. Thanks for clicking on me. For our subscribers and people who've been here before, welcome back. Doing a little love reading. June 2016. Hmm. Let's see what's happening. Let's see, some people struggling in their current relationship. Some of them, some of them, some of you. Uh, this might be the last month for this relationship. So I guess you're getting the bad news and maybe the good news. And then for a lot of people, it looks like this will be a fruitful month for you. Fruitful, as in, it might be a good time to tighten the bonds with the person you're with. It's if you're not already married, as I say. For some of you who have been thinking about someone from the past, it looks like you might get your wish, if it's a wish. But we do have someone coming back. I think this is more for the ladies because I'm getting the strong influence of the male coming back or a male that you're wondering about. You might actually get to have contact with them again and see what's going on. Don't rightfully, don't right away decide that this person wants to get back in a love type of relationship with you. For some, it's not impossible, but there might be some other things going on. As in curiosity of what you might be up to now. For some, that's probably good, but others, uh, you might have some unfinished business, so peeping eyes. And since it's coming up in the love reading, it's probably a past partner of yours who's coming back to see what's up. See what's happening. And yeah, I think it's more of uh, curious eyes. Looks like married people, married folks, legally or spiritually married, it looks like this could be a good month for you. Okay. For the boyfriend-girlfriend situation, you might have a couple uh, disagreements this month. So, um, if it's a new relationship, uh, be careful because we don't want to ruin that, all right? And again, looks like some partnerships might end this month. It's not always a bad thing. Sometimes it's for the better. In the long run, in the long run, you'll see that sometimes it's good to end a relationship. We got the death card on that, so something's ending, ceasing, stopping. So, basically, what we're seeing is new, stronger relationships. But then on the other side, we're seeing that some relationships might be parting this month. But this isn't, the parting relationships isn't unknown, all right? So uh, apparently you've been having some problems for a while and you might be coming to your deadline. So June might be that time of the year for this 
and we're Pisces friends. Unknown feelings about someone on how the person feels about you. Well, I'm getting a lot of good feelings towards you, so don't let the uncertainty get to you. Don't let your mind wander too far. All right? So. No, I'm just saying if there's anything else here. It's pretty much an up and down type of month. End of the month looks a little rougher in the romance department. I'm looking for certain things, and if I'm not seeing them, apparently things are okay in other areas. If somebody wondering about someone making a commitment towards them, I think there could be something like that happening in June. So, it's cool. Not too bad, Pisces. The negative things or for people who already anticipated this, so. Positive, new relationships for a lot of the Pisces folks not in a relationship. A couple disagreements in the boyfriend, girlfriend areas. And some will be getting a commitment. But yeah, you know, a lot of times it's the woman waiting for the man to make some sort of commitment, but uh, apparently there's some men out there waiting for some decision from the ladies. So, I got the money figure popping up also. I keep saying so. Then this little thing that pops up and it's showing that uh, some of you who depend on each other it looks like there could be a financial increase and it's coming up in the love reading so apparently money has been a stress on your relationship anyway let's end this now so remember to thumbs up the reading if you liked it yeah. and don't forget to subscribe down there, the little box that says Mystic Charles Subscribe. Or up there with my sparkly click here to subscribe. So, anyway, it is what it is. And I thank you, and we'll catch you next time.